And we're back to learning Inkscape and this time I'm going to show you how to create a number matrix. We can use an extension and an inbuilt function to create these quickly. First let us create 9 random numbers. I use the type tool for that. They're all in the same text element, extensions, text and split text. This is the extension that we need. We don't have to preserve the original, so uncheck this box. Make it worse. If you have letters, for example, you would split the two digit, three digit numbers as well, and we don't want to have that. Make sure that your text element is active and apply it. Now we'll go to Object and Arrange. I've still got the numbers selected. I want to create a matrix of three times three numbers, so nine in total. You can set the spacing down here. And I've set it to pixels. And as long as your numbers are selected, you can click on Arrange and they're going to be rearranged in this fashion. If you want to create brackets, you can use, for example, the Bezier tool, hold control when you drag these lines. You'll fill in stroke on an object, increase the width for the stroke. Use the notes tool, or control when you reposition the notes. Press control D to copy it, then flip it up here and reposition it. Once again, I hold control when I do that. You can group it, press and control G. Group the numbers as well. Select it all, go to object, align and distribute and align it properly. Then select the bracket, press Ctrl D, hold Ctrl when you drag it to the right and flip it. I hold Shift and click on the other bracket, Ctrl G to group it, select it all, arrange it again. If you wanna resize that now, just hold Shift and you can make it a little bit smaller and both sides are adjusted at the same time. If you want to have round brackets, let me just copy this one and I delete the brackets. You can just use the ellipse tool. Click on the X to get rid of the fill, hold shift and click on the black color swatch to give it a stroke. Now transform it a little bit. Maybe up to here. Hold shift, click on the numbers, arrange it. Create a rectangle on top of your ellipse. Make sure that only the rectangle and the ellipse are selected. So hold shift and click on both. Go to path and cut the path. Now you can delete this part. And once again, press control D to copy the bracket, flip it, reposition it. Then hold shift, click on the other one, group it, control G. Select all elements, so the brackets and the numbers, and arrange it. On the object, fill in stroke, it makes sense to make it a little bit thicker. And that's how you can create a number matrix in Inkscape. I hope this video was helpful, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.